long strokes and small dogs. And our first, what we call the inside dog, is a pack of food. Of the Spaniel and Poodle together. This is Darcy. And Darcy is handled by Abby Sora. And this is the least experienced dog we have with us today because we thought it was really interesting to see how good you have to be even to start to compete. So we're asking Darcy to pay lots of attention to the handler. We've got lots of praise going on, we're, we're talking to you all the time, but we still expect the dog, we might make a few mistakes and not, not quite get the lines right, but even so, even grade one, look at the skill there with Abby and Darcy. Walking the ring now, we from the Spaniel called Blur, handled by Claire Lawrence. Would you believe somebody gave this dog away? Claire's only had the dog since last September. Hope has found out it loves agility. And as you can see, look what could be done with a dog that somebody gave away. If you're thinking about getting a dog, do get one that suits the lifestyle. If you've got a dog and you've never had a go at doing anything like this, go and find your way to the dog club. See what you can do. Get in the dog club. Oh, we love it now. Black Claire and Claire are holding it up. Another youngster and uh, walking the ring now. This is Rose. Rose handled by James Brown. This is a work copper and a cold cross. And as you can see, we put a lot of score with the young dogs. A reward that James has just bringing this dog on. It's the first time I've seen anything like this. And he decided, well, it doesn't matter. We just want to show how much the dog enjoy doing this and what rewards they get. Again, because he's a competitive handler, he has to work the dog at grade three. So he is the one that's catching up. I think we're both grade five, right? Yes, 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 yes. to make sure that even in the stress circumstances for the dog, he gets it right. Go, go. The dog with reward, which is successfully doing a very nice job. Uh, Ladies, if you want to watch, you'll see it on the telly, I'm sure. Now, I thought this was a wicket when it turned out this morning, but it's not. This is Helen, she's back with her second dog. This is Vicky, she's three years old, and it's a Spanish. The Dinko, I don't know if it's me. Helen will be impressed with nothing else. It's basically a Spanish wicket, but it's high time to cross with it. And again, we don't have a best start to my this dog. And Helen goes uh, tearing it on again. You never see too many different things to the level. It's working in grade three of them again, grade three. And as you can see, from the great partnership with Helen, I'm glad to have it. In the shame of the Now, this is my favourite. Well, two of them comes on. This is a border terrier. And a border terrier handled by the baby controls. First Timothy dog. And he does have a bit of safety in the car. The car is kind of an exhibit. He's in the time, as you can see, and uh, he's almost stopping to work. He's aiming to get to chat this year, which is great seven. And uh, great to see yet another breed here at the show. Great one, one, two, nine. Katie Warbanks turned out with her to build the teddy. It's going to be uh, part of the uh, GB team in the World Championships, and they've also won a cross. In the box group of YKC agility, young kennel club agility for the youngsters. Anybody under 21 can run to that. And uh, Katie is a winning member. Big signals as you can see, shows the age. But uh, they become really proficient, make us old ones, really look tired running about. But uh, nicely handled and a lovely partnership between uh, Katie and Kenny.
Now this is Elliot, and Elliot, as you can see, is coming in the ring with our youngest spaniel today. It's a work proper spaniel. This is Taylor Leon. And this is actually Taylor's own dog. She's actually trained this dog. It's not mum's dog or dad's dog, it's her dog. And in the agility world, that means to say things sometimes go well, sometimes they don't. But what I think was fantastic to see this morning was that Taylor, didn't matter when it went wrong, she just kept going and worked at the dog. Oh, and so we got their lunch up there. It's in the Spaniel, after all, he will eat anything Spaniels. But she has kept working, as you can see. And we've got Spaniel trade just hooling for a bit at the moment, but... Uh, <laughs> you make it do it, Taylor. There was that young lady. And again, she's demanding out the dog. I want you to do this. She, I've shown you how to do it. I've trained you. You know what to do. And it's called perseverance. And at eight years old, I reckon that's not a bad okay, to go. 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 Well done, young lady. Well done, well done. So we're moving after 